Wamba Yamba uh, said something. Uh, uh, do we have sound of it? You're not. I'm just going to play the sound. You want to talk about incredulous and stupid? Listen to what Wamba Yamba had to say about the physicality of the NBA game. Go ahead. First of all, the court is more open. Uh, it's going fast, but it's it's less physical and. Uh, and I get fouled a lot, but not as much. <laughs> Nothing to compare. And uh, yes, and people are like, people are here, people, are, players are just flying, you know. Out, out there, it's more underground, pushing underground, big box outs. I just want to make sure we have that because that'll be on his tombstone. Uh, the NBA is less physical than the European game. Mm. <laughs> oh, boy. Hmm. And what's with the Band-Aid on his face? Like, I'm just asking the question. Is that from Britney Spears when she attacked him? <laughs> is that what that is? Was that, was that like one of Britney's it nails was a came vicious attack. And, and got him like, just memo to men. We're not Nelly. We don't wear Band-Aids <laughs> on, on our face. Like, great right? like, that's just Nelly, not, it? it's just, I don't care who you are, it's just not a good look for a guy <laughs> or a woman or anybody for that matter. But for him to say that the European game is more physical, and I guess the point he was trying to make is that the athleticism in the NBA is far greater than the European game. So guys' ability to get up and down the court fast mm -hmm. is what's different. But uh, So I want to give him a pass. But, man, when the number one thing we're all talking about is you got to build up your body so you can handle the physicality of the NBA. And then after two summer league games, you say, it ain't that physical. I'd like to give him a pass on that, but I'm not going to give him a pass on that. He's yeah. going to get his ass handed to him. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not going to give him a pass. Look, I've never played in Europe. I, I don't know what that game is like. However, when you look at the summer league game, this is a lot of guys that are trying to make a roster. So whether they're trying to play great defense or be more physical, who, who knows? One thing I, will, I do know is guys in the leagues, professional guys who have established themselves, when they hear young guys talk like this, they make it a point uh -huh. to ensure you eat those words, yeah. period. I yeah. don't care what sports you're playing in. Yeah. They're going to make it a point that, oh, we're not physical. We're going to well, show you. Well, what's going to happen is the coach, whoever he plays against first, if I'm a coach, I play that quote, and I ought to go, listen, he doesn't think you're all that physical. He thinks you're soft compared to European players. And what are you going to do as a guy with pride? I'm going to, phys I'm going to be more physical. I'm no, you know what you're going to do? What I would do. I'm fouling out. Now, you, really? Oh, yeah. I'm making a point. First preseason you're, you're, you're game, unathletic. it's going to be you're called Hakawambi. That's what it's going to be. <laughs> you, you don't think we play physical in the NBA? Yeah, that's, that was, that's what you would do, right? You give them the knees and the, and the legs. Elbows. You give them the elbows, the whole thing. You get all this. Wow. You get all. You're going full Dan Campbell. Oh, I go knees. full bite kneecaps. Yeah, punch, <laughs> kick, scratch, whatever I got to do. Because I got challenged, right? Now, again, I want to give him a pass. I think I know what he meant to say, what the, the, that the athleticism is a lot different. But he did say it. I could play it again if you want to see it. Hey, I'm not going it. to, but I could play it again because I have that kind of control right here. Amazing. I could just say, Yahtzee, play it, and they'd play it. But I'm not going to ask them to do that because then they'd panic and I'd get in trouble later after the show. <laughs> 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 but that's the case. And one last Wamba Yamba story. Uh, speaking of Britney Spears, uh, apparently he did apologize to her privately at a dinner table uh, somewhere in Vegas, uh -huh. and that's not enough. She would like him to apologize to her publicly. She's also selling a book that she just wrote, and it's hoping that he can help with book sales <laughs> because apparently people think she's bat crazy and nobody wants to buy the book, but that's another story for another day.